against the Ad Venom draft, which basically wants to be fighting constantly. They're going to round it out with pick. an axe. Mm -hmm. Dark, Have you said end the game by 25 minutes? This uh, somewhat accomplished that. Quite enough damage. They almost had another Arctic burn. So jungle axe off to a pretty good start. Oh, they are going back in on Nope here. And he's still level one. No surge. Oh, oh my god, yes! Go fear with the dirt route, you don't run into an ion shell. Oh <laughs> my god. Boy, that is disastrous. Oh no. I mean, at that point, like, you've already basically. He was level one. Now he's almost level three off of that kill. That is a very big kill to be giving up. <laughs> Meanwhile, bottom lane, though. Keep this early for rotation, but this is because the Nature's Prophet not showing in the bottom lane right now. He's only just returned. Hasn't made the call yet, and with the lane pushed, not easy to tell these supports are missing, so they are creeping in. They need that Dragon Tail. She does manage to get it off. Not easy to just waltz up on the Fairy Dragon and score that type of catch, but nice right should be able to get that. Oh, barely draining him down. Good job by the Nature's Prophet there, too. Used to stay alive a bit longer. Ad Finum very reliant on the burst damage, the puck, the, the axe. Like, you want to get the heroes low and then just quickly kill them off. As Skylar grabs the haste and he is going to move in on Aloha Dance. Not at the point in Glyphs yet, only level 2. And he has opted for the other two abilities. So now, going for the Sprout, summons the Trance as the Sprout's about to despawn. And they move in on the Aloha Dance. A couple of auto attacks to get the job done. One more. Skylark, though, the haste is right off, and he's gone. And that was disgusting. Meanwhile, Thug taking a little bit of damage there as the turnaround from Dragon Knight. Now he's in trouble here. Skylark going right on him again. Could this be a double? And he just has to hit him one more time. Will he be able to do it? He will! Not wow. be able to do it no. yet. And never, in fact. No. <laughs> My team! <laughs> Darn it. Nice pull there. No wow. Well. No wow. Well. Right now, sitting at 1200 net worth. He's basically a support hero. Dog. Glimpse oh. back. Aloha dance. Good catch there. And Whew. should likely be going down. Does have a phase shift. Can juke a bit more. Oh, that's the orbit sick. three. Up to the high ground. Neutral deny. Oh, he's away. That was pretty good. Meanwhile, in the top lane, we're getting some action up here in the jungle. What the, the blocks, man? Oh, no. Get him. The spooky tree. They got Spooky stuff. Not having any problem at all is Mr. Soft Spartan. And already 1400 gold. I mean, you called him the, the playmaker of the team, and I, I think that's fair to say at this point. Seems like he has a big impact no matter who he's playing. But what exactly is happening here, LD? Uh, this would be G diving. And does not get the kill. Maybe next time able to heal up with the Cold Embrace. It's a double feed. Okay. Yeesh. Nah, I'm confused. Yeah, yeah. Oh boy, we don't know yet. Is he gonna go for the blink? I like the early game blink. People tell me it's not good that Vanguard first. What do you think? Uh, Vanguard first is also very good. I think it's situational, but they will try to find Thug in the mid lane. Can he make it out again? The great escape artist will not be successful. No. BP just hating on us. Killing creeps? Yeah, because they're they're feeding him. Oh, feeding him the creeps. Very good. Uh oh, trouble for no fear. Top caught up. Tried to get away with the surge, but the crush fall combination Wait. into a chop, into a blink dagger. Uh, Spark will get rolling well in the meanwhile. The mid lane FNG has dove, and that's just three kills. G also dragged into that one. D. Oh, oh and then yeah. Dunk, dunk, dunk. We're gonna need to come up with a word for dunk. I thought I'd do a pump. Pazang! Pazang and. Kazook! Kabuka. Kabuka, but that! What the hell is that? This thug is getting just passed around <laughs> like a rag doll. Didn't Jeez. manage to drop the coil though. No follow up. Fear. And they are looking to cut him off. Yep. While well, that's happening, there's a glitch in the mid lane and they do catch up thug again. The so Blake Mole at the top rune, so it looks like two kills might be happy also with Skylark. It does come into mid, boy, he would sure love to have that ultimate. Does not have the nature's rest, so they get the dark here. They're gonna manage to bring down the disruptor as well. And they might even find V2. Blink, call, first spin, pure damage, great damage against the Dragonite, and a chop. A chop? That's new! Dang, we didn't even. I guess I was wrong. I mean, with a, with a cape like that, he is better. Yeah, that is for sure. Oh! Look at that! Uh. This could backfire. Nope, maybe not. Winter Waterman. The great ultimate there, it almost kills! Damn well! Skylark looks great, man. Axe is coming back in. Uh, no, he doesn't end up going down, actually. So he's out of the fight, but no fear. And he back is 
the nation drop and the Skylark goes in super deep and Darwin to get into this. Again, the Cold of Race plays hurting the day and FNG is going to end up likely dropping here. He does drop and Yoku being chased out of it. Of course, back behind the tower. That's Venom. Looking to turn this one. Static oh. Storm deployed, but Madara is easily armless toggling his way out of that. But round two comes with the glimpse, the armless toggle again. They need a little more damage over time to force him back to the well. Can't quite do it. It's commit. Does might end up dropping through. No fear. Eh, he'll go down. Puck the trade. Slaughter to escape. DP's looking for They want to do a little better than that, but as long as they're trading LD, it ain't so bad. They got a pretty decent late game, right? What just happened to Winter Fireman? Got killed by the time all trades. Tier one top for a Roshan. Okay. Ideally, you'd like to be taking tier two, but frankly, if you're VP, you're gonna take what you can get at this point. Uh, they have equalized the gold up on the axe along with uh, Max Call and Spin, and they have the ultimate on the Wyvern. The one here is really struggling to of course, the uh, Punk. Oh, what a call! There we go, right before the Disruptor ult, and it's just gonna be a clean up duty here. Winter Wyvern looking for the right ult. To take Drop him! Drop him! Here we go! Oh, no. Spartan, good spin, though. That is back, that is. Yeah. My god, VP just dominated right there. The poor little Darkseer. No, the illusionary orb increased by one. I thought that was an Ags upgrade because it was so OP. Speed by one. <laughs> I wonder what the reason for that is, actually. I could name one, LD. Yeah. The okay. illusionary orb speed. Here we go, fight breaking out the top lane as uh, they do match the glimpse back to Ace's prop and keep him out of the fight. Madara getting scouted out here, I believe. No, Wormy is way through the trees, is able to juke for the time being, and he, now he comes out angry, looking for the crush, and the lead air ball, but not far, and that's the special delivery. Wait to lead now, quick two hero assassination. Might be a third coming soon, no fear, in the trees. He'll go down as well. And it's just BP hero after BP hero hitting the deck, going back to the well. 26 to 10, a massacre. Oh, BP. And getting ugly. BP, I mean, things were looking good, LD. Things were looking okay for BP. And then suddenly Axe came out of the jungle. Wait a second, though. Maybe next time. Oh, maybe this time. Another. <laughs> He's out. He's ahead of his name. It's like, hey, everyone else feed, you stupid ass. Oh, God. Get back. They are moving in. They want to cross bar. It has the blade now, though. They need to change on this. He pops the blade now. Now, not such a promising target. Maybe next time, able to embrace and keep him alive. Out comes the Star Storm. Follow up. Paul gets popped to keep a little more breathing going. But they do call the next three hero cross comes out. Now, the Wyvern also say goodbye with the Puzzle. They need that little extra bit of damage, Skylark. He's looking for the Maelstrom auto, auto attacks here. As Yoku engages on him, isolates the NP. Arrow just goes right through it. Auto, essentially. One more auto attack case. At the same time, the Angry Dragon moves forward. DP diving this one hard. X still down for 15 seconds. Can they call off Madara here? Doesn't seem like it. Oh, nicely done there. Swap out on the Mirana in the bench stun. But it, it will cost them one. The Dark Seer down. Score 27 to 14, but a really hard play. Stop! You can't pass. <laughs> but here we go, at Phantom, linking up, they look for the call on Zod's part, and he instead of forced to pop the blade, now Loha Dance, a wild ultimate, doesn't look very effective, but then they get the back, and back, and try to connect, a great combo play for here for BP, they need that damage output, it's not getting it, pump, dropping nothing, Viper, no ultimate, so it's going to be up to Zod's part, the blade not going down though, for 3 seconds time, can he get enough damage out? Without the support of his friend, Madara goes in for the Blink Crush, but Yoku is able to easily sidestep it with the point blank Blink Dagger usage. Sick stuff from him. Though, as I say that, uh, it looks like he might meet the Chopper Man. Ooh, tries to leap away, the turnaround comes. No, it is going to be four, possibly five. Kind of into the trees. It is five heroes down. BP finding their footing here. It might be a little bit too late to advance, but they're looking good. And now the Chop Show could begin. Yep. Blink Dagger on cooldown in three. Taking some time. Oh, Roche has been spotted by both teams. Marana ult in. That's the Moonlight Shadow. And there's the ult revealing that instantly. They call this is the big team fight that they've been looking for. They get off the puzzle a bit. Look for the shot to begin. Axe though to try and turn it around. They need to keep Madara alive a bit longer. They lose the axe. They have finished off too, but it's coming at cost to Skylark. May get cleaned up here momentarily by Yoku. That Aghanim's doing work at Venom. They just don't have the firepower to get all these kills. They might be able to find the Pogba, blink up, silence, 
comes and well, it will be a three for four in the end so far as much. Come on, look at that. A four for four now. That's it, I'm stuck, backing off. Try my static storm and the five for four. Damn. Really big turn of events overall. BP now. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Not much on that, can't capitalize on They're a little afraid to see the rest of the team behind it, but there we go. Nice, done, all oh, the attack. All day. See another one. Get the bazookas ready. Looking for more. They have committed a curse here onto Aloha Dance. This is up there now. A call. And the triple chop. But the last pitch up goes away. It's a little dark. Still a lot of locked up going through this to crush the call, but this is a potentially very big item. Yep. Right here, Roshan goes down, they're gonna give it to Slardar. Sca Very intimidating, they do walk up the ramp, through the river, towards the Dire Neutral. Whoa! Like Crush to start it off, they are gonna find Skylar, Garrett to follow up, they need Bizarre in here, catch the Crush off, and it will end up being on to the call on through the Blade Mail actually, now Doug coming in, dropping the combo, can they finish these kills off though? They've done a lot of damage, but Crush for not enough, they're gonna lose two again. Great setup, just can't finish. Yep, as you were saying before, man, just not enough damage with this combo. They're gonna be calling back the Winter Fiber, and she's gonna go down as well. I mean, they have to, they, it was perfect, it was the perfect call. And the thing is, every time you lose one of those fights, the supports get items. So now the bench, while you're out the point booster, uh, sitting at 1400 health. Oh boy. Quite safe for a lot of people here. Oh no. Roger won't be making it out of this one, I don't believe. Man, nice catch though by the ultimate on Ninja's Crossing. Woo! And they look for more. Swap comes through on Skylark. The Yule Scepter now to play. Hopping the BKB. Turning with the auto attack on the FNG. Gonna finish him off as well. That's two. Looking for a third. And with the creep blocks. Looks like they... Oh! oh will not dunk him, but... Can't fall him soon. Yeah. Ends up getting the kill. Beautiful stuff there. Oh, it's almost spawned and... Moonlight Shadow, they're looking for something. Oh no! Axe initiation, but a swap! Not gonna be too much there. Winter Wider. What is going on, LD? Pretty good first. The soft part and does get caught out, but he's fairly tanky. No fear. Maybe I'm breaking the coil. Madara coming in just for the short range across. Does manage to find it now at first as well. Has the other line Spartan jumping in with into the Marana Nukes. Will end up going down. Yoku looking for the turn. And BP. Here's like they might be taking a fight yet again. And they finish this puck. Uh, Yule Scepter surviving for the time being up to the north. Skylark able to keep you away. And it looks like it will be a two for two. Uh, yeah. The thug ends up going down. Reported yep. to the on the illusions, it's good to kill something. Yeah, really messed them up. Yeah, man. They are gonna go though. Get the clip back on Saw Spartan. Gotta be careful if you just embrace it. It's easily on the go down. Next to the shot. They are committing a bit far. Aloha dance though. Gets purged. Where's the follow up? It's Madara with the crush. And now the jump in the ball. Up the pod on to Aloha dance. And G. But G fighting his way through this one. Pretty damn tanky. Skylark with the BKB. Engage as well. The swap back. Well played by FG. Yoku. A uh, little too much damage and Phantom starting to hammer his kills in the fight. Three down with the buyback. Could be more as they rush towards the bottom lane. They punt for the Wyvern. Oh, I almost found them too. Close call with Max back. The second helping. Or maybe to give second helping. We'll wait and see. As you mentioned, this week's episode is, uh, well, it's, it's feeding. Yep. That's pretty unfortunate. How to feed your heroes. I see it had Phantom. Thug trying to make it. I mean, the 10 second cooldown on swap, especially in a game like this where positioning is everything, things have got to line up. Wait a second! Oh no! It's a, it's a, death. it's a kill! Oh god! He's dead, LD. You could be falling and you're still winning. He's just gonna go to the racks. So don't be trouble through it! Here we go! Uh oh, stop, start, and they get the vision on it now. The short range clips them down. No fear committing. Diving for this one. Blinking forward, the swap back, the slightly awkward coordination here. They do get off a curse onto G. Not taking much damage. The arrow check is on the bar, and that's just likely an axe down to throw the fight. Indeed, it is. Madara now low. And being chased as Skylark gets swapped by FNG. They're going to blink into Dragonite, stun him, and chain stun him, and bring him down. That's three dead. It might well be a fourth here. No the match after that axe. It's a pretty good item. Wowee! And that's a massive match, Dragonite. Oh, God. 
BP having a little bit of fun here as they close in on what could be their first lane of rack. Possibly more. Skylark is uh, pushing in the bottom lane, but they don't care. Oh, they're throwing it. BP just seriously going for tier four towers. They want to close this game out right now. 35 minutes, ready to get the job done and the swaps. You did say it. Their action god, Paul Ben. <laughs> Here we go. Yeah, they're going to skip everything they say. You want to ride us? Okay. We will throw you. Yep. And VP will do just that. Taking the game here, securing their honor. Woo! Uh, but still, unfortunately, I believe, not advancing anyway. Nope. Well, you got to hand it to them, you know? They could have just thrown this game away, not cared at all, and they did their damnedest, and they showed that they had a chance. Axe is going to maybe get some more decapitations here. Oh. But it ain't going to matter. VP with the victory. Mr. LD. Yeah, at Venom, felt a little sloppy and a little bit loose with their play, but again, I, I do think the draft is like damage. Uh, Puck had a really poor start, a lot of pressure on him in the mid lane, uh, something that at Venom probably needs to work on for the next game, but still looking good uh, heading towards the playoffs. Yeah. Sounds good. Sounds good. All right, great. Well, that was an exciting game. Thank you so much, LD. I had a great time casting you.